What's up guys, Corbin with the Wasatch Gear Review. Tonight I'm going to be doing a controlled test of some gear of mine. I don't have any winter per se gear yet and we're getting down to about 28 degrees tonight and there's a 60% chance of snow. So I've never tried the minimalist um, setup. <clears throat> I mean I've had it set up in minimal minimalist structure but I've never actually slept in it and definitely not in really inclement weather so 60% chance of snow tonight and uh, 28 degrees is a low so I'm gonna test out minimalist I'm testing out uh, my bag I'm testing out some dry sacks probably uh, well, ones I've already tested out quite a bit but I have a new one for uh, paddling this next summer a little thicker one that I'd like to just see how it works so anyway guys uh, Thanks for joining me. It should be fun. Um, like I said, it's a controlled. Uh, what I mean by controlled is it's out back of uh, my parents' house, out in their backyard. So you know, when I'm testing things that I don't quite know how they're gonna go, I, sh I like to be in a controlled environment, of course, before I take them out into the back country. So anyway, that's what's cracking tonight, guys. Should be pretty fun. Thanks for joining again. Alright guys, it is, uh, let's see, 617 at night, I think it's 35 degrees outside, feels like temperature is 23, and um, wind is about 22 mile an hour, gusts up to 30, but that's supposed to die down to about 14 degree, uh, miles an hour later tonight. We are expected to start getting snow in around 11 o'clock this evening, all the way until about 4 o'clock or 5 o'clock in the morning. They're saying up to an inch of accumulation. We'll see what happens. But uh, i got to tell you right now, it's really nice inside the shelter. Um, I do have it at minimalist pitch, so that means there's no bug netting, no floor other than the um, footprint for the tent is down. So. I'll flip the camera around and show you guys basically the view of the inside of this tent. Alright guys, so you can see how the footprint is stretched out and staked. It is waterproof, but you can see how all around me is open to the ground. There comes the wind right there, and guys, I'm not feeling any of that wind. Um, this rain tarp is keeping all the wind off me. Very nice. <coughs> so I just kind of want to give you guys a view of the inside. Let me I can turn around a little bit and show you guys. My sleeping quarters. So, yeah, there's the, all right, and I've just got um, a really good Thermarest uh, self-inflating self pad. That's the base camp. It's meant for winter. And then I also have a small uh, foam pad down underneath that. And then I have my 5 degree sleeping bag, and inside of that I have a 40 degree sleeping bag. So, we should be cozy tonight. Um, right, like I said, right now sitting inside here, it's, it's very cozy, very nice, uh, dry, completely dry, away from the wind, and away from any moisture that falls. So, we'll see how the night proceeds, guys. Hey guys. So it's uh, 8.30 at night, it's about 30 degrees outside, um, I think it's about 34 degrees inside my tent, or inside the shelter, 35.6 degrees actually. So it's a few degrees warmer in here than it is, almost 6 degrees warmer. Uh, inside than it is outside so that's pretty good 
Um, my double bag's working out just fine so far. Uh, definitely warm laying here. Um, one of the big things I wanted to see, um, that's why I'm kind of hoping it snows tonight, um, is the condensation buildup from my breath on the inside of of the shelter tonight and on my bag. So in the morning, it's going to be definitely uh, interesting to see. I'm um, definitely dry, warm, and uh, just waiting for the snow to come in. Maybe 11 o'clock by the time it hits is what the forecast is saying, but we'll see guys. If anything eventful happens, I'll bring you back. Hey guys, good morning. So it's uh, 5 o'clock in the morning. Alarm just went off to get ready for work. Let's see. It is 32 degrees. And I slept like a baby last night. Nice and warm. No problems at all. It definitely snowed. I'll give you guys a shot of the outside of the tent. I already knocked some of the snow off it wasn't a whole bunch but I night lightly knocked off all the snow already so I'm gonna jump out give you guys a shot of the tent and I'm gonna get ready for work so have a good morning everyone so I already knocked off the bunch that was on top As you can see here this was all open around the bottom last night it's kind of sealed off with snow. Not a bad night at all. Hey guys, in the truck and ready to go to work. I uh, just wanted to do a little, just touch on the fact that we did get snow and I had very little uh, condensation on the inside of that shelter last night and really none at all on my on my bag so all in all I'm very surprised for you know I didn't use the insert the bug netting for the tent but it is only recommended for three seasons of course we're not in winter yet so that could say something also but uh, I gotta say it all worked out fine I was rather warm never really got cold throughout the night I was always comfortable so there you have it guys testing somewhat done um, definitely could probably use that setup not midwinter but early winter I'm thinking we can so we'll just have to see I'm gonna give it a shot on another night that we get a lot of snow and see what happens because that's usually the problem is the weight of the snow on top of the shelter um, can cause you problems, cause you grief for three seasons. So we'll see how it goes. But anyway, guys, that test is over. Off to work I go. Be safe and adventure on, everyone.